Hey folks, uh, welcome in here to the News 12 Now Desk. Quick breaking news update. Uh, Richmond County Deputy Ty Daly has turned himself in to the Burke County Detention Center. Let me pull this up uh, so you can see. This video came from about 15 minutes ago uh, down at the Burke County Detention Center. You see he is uh, going in to turn himself in, expected to be charged in a deadly crash that happened um, last year. Our I team it reported pretty extensively on this. Will Rio has been looking into this for us. If you go to our website, WRDW.com, it's our top story there right now. You can click on that, and we have links to all of our earlier coverage on this case in case you uh, aren't exactly brushed up on what this is. So this crash happened in March of 2023 when Daly was driving a Richmond County Sheriff's Office car. Georgia State Patrol says 75-year-old Jay Fager died in that crash. So. Uh, the, again, this video is coming from about 15, 20 minutes ago down at the Burke County Detention Center right now. Uh, our crew is down there at 825 when Ty Daly got to the detention center. We've reached out to get an update on exactly what he's going to be charged with and some more details on that. But again, this is in reference to uh, a crash that happened in March of 2023 when Daly was driving a Richmond County Sheriff's Office car. So we have at least four stories on this. Again, if you want to go to our website, WRDW.com, uh, you can look through all those and get well versed and up to date with what's going on there. But just wanted to bring you this quick breaking news update and uh, we'll bring you more information as we get it. But Richmond County Deputy Ty Daly has turned himself in in Burke County uh, in regards to a fatal crash that happened in March of 2023. So again, we'll bring you more updates as they come in.